New York City's new mayor, Eric Adams, has upset some folks over comments regarding a sector of the city's workforce. Adams said low-skilled workers don't have the academic skills to sit in a corner office. His comments quickly went viral, but there's more to that story. To tell us more, we got BNC's Drake Clark. He is live in New York City with more about the mayor's comments. Tell us about that, Dre. Well, Tashani, New York City Mayor Eric Adams has never really been ashamed to talk about his blue-collar upbringing. He grew up poor. His mother raised six children on her own. So his comments yesterday uh, regarding low-skilled workers, many of them black and brown, really caught people by surprise, and some people even thought uh, his comments were condescending. Uh, but his remarks came at the end of an hour-long news conference. That news conference was held inside a small business in Chinatown. The mayor signed an executive order eliminating unnecessary fines and violations that could really hurt small businesses or in some cases lead to them being shut down. Adams was then asked about large corporations and businesses allowing their employees to work from home. Adams says he would prefer those workers come back to the office sooner than later uh, because if not, many small businesses will die and it will devastate the city's economy. The cleaners, the restaurants, the coffee shops, etc. They all need the foot traffic to survive in a city like this. And it was during a question and answer session that the mayor made these comments. My low skilled workers, my cooks, my dishwashers, my messengers, my shoe shine people, those who work in Dunkin' Donuts, they cannot, they don't have the academic skills to sit in a corner office. They need this. We are in this together. And we should be saying to ourselves, if I remotely do my job, then that stock clerk is not going to be able to have the business he, des he deserves. That's what I need us to understand. And so when you hear his comments from that perspective, it might change your mind or perhaps it, it won't at all. Uh, but Mayor Adams is not known for biting his tongue, and he's also not known for being condescending uh, or talking down to people. But certainly there have been other mayors throughout the city's history who have done that, especially when it comes to poor black and brown people. The mayor says he's simply trying to save as many small businesses as he can, and they really can survive without people coming back to the office there in Midtown Manhattan and in other places. We're live in Harlem. I'm Dre Clark for BNC. Tashani. All right, Dre, thanks for that report.